Hey, welcome to my channel, Cooking with Manual Focus, and today we're going to be making a Parmesan bacon shrimp scampi. I know you see these ingredients, they'll be in the description box below. Now we're going in with a shallot. This is going to provide a nice tangy, sweet note to our base. We got some garlic, we're going to mince this up. This is going to give it some buttery, sweet tones. Now we got this Italian parsley. It's going to provide some minty, citrus notes. Now this is the start of the dish. We got these shrimp. These are large shrimp. We're going to get these seasoned with some Creole seasoning. Now we're going to season it until our souls say it's ready to go. Now when you got enough seasoning, we're going to set this to the side and we're going to let this marinate a little bit. Now let's work on this bacon. Now we got our skillet heated up to a medium heat. Now we don't want to overcook this bacon where it becomes too crispy. And then we don't want this bacon to be too rubbery. Now we're going to come back to that. We got our angel hair pasta. We want to cook this al dente because we're going to multitask a little bit, right? We got to have everything coming out at the same time. Now you can use whatever pasta that you like. Now back to that bacon. This is a perfect consistency that we want. Like I said, not too crispy, not too rubbery, but it's going to provide a nice little bite and it's going to pair well with that shrimp. Now, I know you see all that fun in the bottom of that pan. We're going to get to that a little bit later. Now, we're going to go back to that shrimp. Still over medium heat, we're going to add this to that skillet. Now, this isn't going to take long to cook at all. It's going to take about a minute each side. So, by the time that you get everything in that skillet, it's going to be about time to flip the very first shrimp that you put in that skillet. So, when it starts turning, you know, a little white, whitish color, then it's ready to go. You can flip that. And then we're going to cook this for an additional minute. Now, all that flavor that's in the bottom of that pan from that baking grease is going to infuse into those shrimps and it's going to create a nice flavor now those right there are perfectly done now let's work on the sauce now we got two tablespoons of butter going in with our shallot and our minced garlic now we're going to cook this until it becomes fragrant now once it becomes fragrant we're going to add a half a cup of white wine now i'm using pinot grazio wine and then we're going to glaze this pan for all that fun that's on the bottom that's gonna provide that additional flavor. Now we're gonna let the sauce simmer for about 10 minutes and then we're gonna go in with some Parmesan cheese grated. This is about two tablespoons of Parmesan cheese. Now you can go you know, heavier if you like, but two tablespoons will be perfect. And then get this in that mixture, mix it in well. And then after that, after you let it simmer for about another minute or so, you're going to add a whole lemon squeeze and this is going to provide additional citrus notes and it's going to pair well with that shrimp. It's going to provide that nice tangy taste that's going to just like kiss that shrimp and you in the game. Now we're going to add that shrimp back into that skillet and then we're going to hit it with that Italian parsley. Let those flavors marinate and marry and that shrimp is going to be absolutely delicious and flavorful. Now, you want to add your pasta back into the skillet. Now, again, I use angel hair. You can go with the pasta choice that you like. Get everything tossed in that sauce. And then don't forget, add about a half a cup of pasta water back into this mixture. And then you in the game. Now, all you got to do is add that bacon on top that was cooked perfectly. And then put your Parmesan cheese great however much you like go heavy if you like go light if you like do whatever you like this your kitchen but now you have effective immediately absolutely delicious parmesan bacon shrimp scampi and you're in the game and you already know what we got to do we got to get us a taste test get you some of that shrimp and that bacon right there, you in the game. Cheers, fam. Now, that is absolutely delicious, fam. Now, if you're new to this channel and you like this content, go ahead and smash that like button. And by the way, smash that subscribe button so you know when I release my content. For the people that's been rolling me for a while, focus fam, you already know what I gotta do. I gotta smash into this bacon, parmesan, shrimp, scampi, and we'll see you guys on the next recipe. Peace.